Breaking the Wall of Tile Manufacturing Emma Horn, Falling Walls Lab, Cape Town Ceramic tiles. 16 billion square meters were produced globally last year. That's enough to tile the whole surface of Berlin almost 20 times over. Cured at temperatures in excess of 1,000 degrees Celsius, ceramics can eat up almost 2% of all energy used in a country. This industry has barely changed in thousands of years. Natural gas is commonly used in the global ceramics industry. While in countries like South Africa, energy is derived from coal. Both are finite resources. Neither is ideal. Either way, carbon dioxide is released into the atmosphere. Therefore, we require innovative methods of producing tiles that utilize less energy and have a lower impact on the environment. To achieve sustainable cities and communities, we need to disrupt this industry. The solution? Bio-tiles. I use a process inspired by nature where particular bacteria catalyze a reaction to form bio-cement. Fundamentally, the bacteria are fed a solution of calcium and carbonate, causing them to combine into calcium carbonate. This is what seashells are made out of. I use this technology to grow bio-tiles for interior and exterior walls and floors. It is possible to form a layer of nacre on the surface of the tile for enhancing the aesthetics. But there's more. I have developed a novel 3D printer to automate the overall process, making it flexible and highly scalable. In addition to this, instead of the sand or clay commonly used, waste resources such as unrecyclable glass or plastic or even mine tailings can be used to make up the base. You name it, as long as the particles are of the right size, they can be bio-cemented together. After two years of dedication, I have made tiles as strong as conventional tiles. And there's no reason to stop here. This technology could disrupt the, great, the greater construction industry and replace bricks, cement, and other ceramics. So why tiles of all things? Tiles are a high-value product. And globally, the industry is worth over 350 billion euros. So what does all of this actually mean? This idea has the potential to be profitable and change an age-old industry radically for the first time. It also means reducing carbon emissions and energy dependency while helping industries manage their waste, thus creating circular economies. <coughs> By producing biotiles, I am breaking the wall of tile manufacturing. Mm -hmm.